This segment of the exchange on My West Michigan is sponsored by the law offices of David L. Carrier. David has built a career of helping people create a plan for their futures, but he also offers a series of <laughs> workshops. You're laughing. Well, these workshops help people address topics other than the law. And coming up this Wednesday, there's a session called Fraud Prevention and Your Safety, which addresses right. out scamming the scammers, but also a whole financial fraud protection aspect. right we have we have uh, one of the folks from the Kent County Police uh, Kent County Sheriff's, Sheriff's Office yeah right they're uh, coming there doing one of our visiting experts so uh, I know it's hard to believe that I don't know everything I mean <laughs> Miami but uh, but there are actually lots of things I have no idea about anyway um, the whole fraud pre prevention thing is we bring in experts sometimes financial experts sometimes people good with Social Security this and that uh, you know, we're going to do a antiques roadshow for your heirloom jewelry. I mean, we've yeah, got a guy awesome. coming in. Yeah, uh, Engel. You know, Dennis Engel is yes. going to come in and do that one. Um, but this one has to do with the fraud. You know, online fraud's a big deal. Have a lot of seniors ta being taken advantage mm -hmm. of. Yeah. So how do we prevent that? Well, um, the sheriff's department they have a whole program, so you're more than welcome. Uh, there will be coffee and cookies as there always are. Yeah. Uh, but. That's the that's just part of uh, the other stuff that we're doing. Yeah. Now t the, this is today, tax day. today, today's tax day. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It's not the fifteenth; it's the eighteenth. But so they give you a whole extra weekend to sweat over getting your taxes in. <laughs> you gotta love those people. Yes. And but but here's the thing: it gives us a little opportunity to talk about uh, attitude. Okay. Um, a lot of folks, when it comes, you know, we talk about the long-term care and planning and blah blah blah. A lot of people take the attitude on the long-term care on uh, that on the whole Medicaid thing yeah. that you should really oh don't worry about it uh, I get this pushback all the time from attorneys where it's like uh, you really shouldn't do anything about it you should just wait and see what happens because when you grow old and your time comes where you're in that position it'll take care of you is it'll that take idea? care of you and it. the idea is you start writing the twelve thousand dollars a month to the nursing home then call us uh, then okay that's now too late, right? well you know that's my attitude you see because so here's the idea you ready for this yeah i'm ready all right today's tax day this is the irs <laughs> now do you want to be the couple with the smurf as your tax lawyer it's like here you go buddy have this oh and by the way i got i got some more over here for you oh but now we'll try to deal with it when the you know do you let the irs do your taxes mm. and then we'll talk to them about it I mean, that's the attitude. Well, yeah. our attitude is we're the black, you see, this is black knight. I, I like say, it. I like right? it. So the IRS comes by, bang oh, you know, you aren't getting my stuff. <laughs> well, it's the same attitude. I mean, do you want a tax lawyer who's going to fight for you? Do you want an elder law attorney who's going to say, oh, wait until this guy, so here's our other guy, this guy shows up, right? And who's he? Oh, that's long term, lawsuits in long term care. Oh, got see? it. Yeah, he's, yeah. he's even worse than he's the IRS. He's menacing too. Yeah, yeah. he's got w wings and everything, right? <laughs> so the question is, do you want the guy, you know, oh, you know, here, take some of this. Oh, and by the way, maybe we can save a donut or two. Or do you want the, you know, when you're faced with that situation, it's like, look, we're not going to leave the donuts out on the plate. We're not going to make it available for them just to take if they want to. And, yeah. oh, if something happens, maybe we'll figure out a way to save a donut or two. Yeah. It's like, no, no, no. We're going to set up the trust. We're going to do it right. So when this guy shows up, it's like, close the lid. You aren't getting my stuff. Mm, you see? It. And it's, it's, it's really a, how do you want to approach the problem? Is it a, hey, you know, we're going to be nice to these guys, or no, we're going to we're going to defend you. Don't put a Smurf in charge of your future. That's the takeaway <laughs> this morning. And if you invite him to a party, he'll bring a, he'll bring dessert. I'm going to invite him to a life plan workshop. There How you about go. that? David does them regularly, and you need to go online. You can find out all the dates, and also that fraud prevention workshop. It's April 20th. That's this Wednesday at two o'clock at David's office on the East Belt Line in Grand Rapids. We've put a link to his website on our website, so you can reserve spots in all of those. Thank and you, you know David. we are doing. We are. We gotta go. We gotta go. Zero. See ya.